Alright guys, today we are headed out here on Hirschfeld and once again to continue a search for my most wanted rare which is the Melanistic Pheasant. So on this occasion, in order to hopefully increase the chances to come across one of those Melanistics, today we'll be doing some server hoping where apart from having a certain chance to find a Mela Rooster, we may also stumble onto some monsters like this potential level 3 Pheasant. You know this track may lead us to the first diamond of the hunt, so we gotta find it. Okay, warning call from a female. Maybe part of the same flock. Well, she's actually coming this way, and if she flies on this direction, I would also expect a big one to do the same. Let's see. Except that now she's flying to the east. So it's very likely the big one already did what this female just did, and he already flew away. You know, we'll have to continue a chase, which hopefully won't get too long, because in the case this rooster is not a level 3, I would hate to track it for multiple kilometers without being a diamond. Okay, that is a female flying towards us. Which may be a good sign, since the rooster is probably gonna do the same. And that must be him. How big is it? Alright, he's coming in. Level 2, top estimate of 20. He's landing, so I'ma drop him as soon as he takes off again. Let's see. And that's it, we dropped him. So honestly, being a level 2, and regardless of the diamond score being within the top estimate, I don't expect this guy to be a diamond, mainly because it's very rare when the level 2s make it. He's an 18.59, he's a gold. We tracked it for nearly a kilometer, which is not too bad, considering that it's usual to track these guys for more than 2 kilometers before getting a chance to shoot him, I mean it's not too rare. So let's continue and let's try to find an actual diamond. Another promising track. You know, this timer is from a max estimate wild boar, which could be a level 5, and in case it is actually a max level, I'ma try to get him using the recurve, since it's been a long time since the last time I used it on a wild boar. I mean, I remember getting one that was close to max score back on 2021, and I'm pretty sure that was the last one, so definitely a very old kill, and you know, I would like to get a more recent one for whenever I decide to make another video of every single diamond in the game with the recurve. Alright, there goes the group. Can we spot him here? Not yet, but in a moment. Okay, that one is a level 3 female. And that one is a max estimate level 4. Unfortunately, I've never seen a level 4 diamond wall were posted, so I really don't think that they are actually able to make it, and I wouldn't consider this guy a diamond potential. You know, he may still be massive, I've gotten a few level 4s above 140 in the past, so this one may be close, but not a diamond. Although it is just a medium sized bacon with a score of 123.28, he's honestly slightly smaller than I thought he would be. Frankly, seeing this score, I'm not exactly happy about the fact that we had to track it for more than 2 kilometers. I mean, it's just a medium sized gold. Now, that's something. A potential diamond level 2 European rabbit. It is very common for this species to make diamond below max level, actually I would say that I have more level 2 diamonds than level 3s, and all of them had the exact same estimate this guy has, hence I say it is a diamond potential. So I certainly wouldn't be surprised at all if this pony ends up being the first diamond of the hunt, a diamond European rabbit after several months since the last one. Hamatrope using the Cachatore. And that's it. You know, there are a few more rabbits over there, so I'ma try to hit at least one more. No idea how big was that, but we definitely hit it. Just imagine if it is a level 3. Well, surprisingly we got 2 on the first attempt, and this one is the one we shot last, which I didn't even spot. Although it's only a female, so nothing special. And now let's see the size of this max estimate. Maybe diamond. 2.16, he's only a gold. He ended up being quite far from the diamond score, which is 2.42, so we're gonna have to keep looking for a diamond. That's a diamond. 
a level 5 fallow deer. He has an estimate of 234 to 286 and we spotted him right on this area at the fallow deer drink time. You know, it's actually a shame that I didn't see it while he was drinking because we would have had the opportunity to get him using the recurve. And now we're gonna have to track it for who knows how long. I mean, here on Hirschfelden it's normally hard to track the animals due to the fact that it's the most dense map on the entire game. There's simply a lot of vegetation and it's hard to see him. Now in the meantime, as we try to spot this guy again, I wanna talk a bit about the possibility of a new DLC coming to the Honor Call of the Wild really really soon, in the very near future. You know, in case you didn't know, we are currently at that time of the year where we usually get some new content added to the game, normally in the shape of a new weapon pack or some sort of new equipment, so I would certainly expect to see an official announcement in one of the upcoming expansive world streams, especially considering that it has already been implied that something new is coming to the game really soon, and I'm really excited to see what it is. I mean, it could be simply another weapon pack or maybe even a new trophy lodge. Oh, he's running this way. Come on. Man, we lost sight of it. Well, he should be down there with all those females, and there's an open area just ahead of us, so we should have a chance to shoot him here. Let's see. Where did he go? I mean, he can't be too far, he must be there. Well, that's strange, he must have taken a different path because there are no signs of it over there. Oh, there he is! Why did he took so long? I assume he got stuck somewhere. Or apparently for some reason he went behind the fence right there and maybe got stuck for a moment. So anyway, let's see a score of this bug, it is pretty much a guaranteed diamond since the rack is the diamond rack and the estimate was pretty decent. And in fact there is a 256.6, he's a diamond. We hit a double long and deliver at less than 100 meters after a chase of nearly 2 kilometers. Not bad for the first diamond of the hunt. Now let's continue. Alright guys, different session, and this time I stumbled across a track of what could be a diamond potential bison, and even though it is unlikely, it is still very possible that this track will end up leading us to our second level 5 this week. Now, going over the places where it's possible to find the species, the European bison is present across a wide range of locations, mainly inside the left section of the map. In this entire Tichenau region and the Bondorf region, the two areas that seem to have the highest concentration of bisons on the entire map. You know, there are many lakes where you can expect to find a great amount of bisons at their drink time, which is from 10 to 2 pm, like for example these two lakes down here are very good. Also, this part of the river up here tends to be very decent. Same case for this lake, which usually also has plenty of bison. And I can't forget to mention this other area, which is also fantastic and perhaps the best location to hunt bisons on the entire map. You know, I found many diamonds here. Alright, I assume that's a hurt. We got a level 2 right there. A level 3. Another level 3. And that one is a level 4 where the top estimate of 121, that is the one we were looking for. Although the estimate doesn't leave any room for a surprise, he won't be a diamond. So I'ma drop him using what I think is the best rifle to hunt bisons, which is the 470. And that should be enough. He's going down. Let's see a score, we know it won't be massive regardless of the level 4 pythons having a real chance to make diamond, mainly because the estimate was simply not high enough so he doesn't have a chance. And he's a 117.81, he's a really small max estimate, he's 10 points shy from the diamond score which is a lot, so not a diamond unfortunately, but at the end of the day he's a decent python and certainly a nice way to conclude the hunt.